Good morning, everybody. So today is not a particularly fun day. <laughs> Let's just put it that way. Today I have to go get my, so I had a filling probably like four weeks ago at this point. I'm definitely overdue, but just because of my schedule, this was a day that I ended up scheduling it for, but I have to go get my crown. And I don't know what that consists of. I don't know if there's more shots involved. I have no idea. <laughs> All I know is I hope that it's just a super quick um, thing. But I went to work this morning after dropping Ella off and I didn't realize that I don't have a lot of the produce that I actually need to prep. So I did what I could, but I literally, I was there for like an hour and 20 minutes. <laughs> and then I was like, oh, well, I'm out of stuff to do and I have to leave early today anyways for this appointment. So I'm like, well, I'm just gonna leave. I already made up some hours this week. I'm gonna go home and get some editing done. So that's where I'm on my way now is just to go home. TJ and I are gonna get a quick bite to eat because it's lunchtime now. But then I'm gonna I'm gonna get some work done while I can and then we'll go to this appointment. So I'll bring you guys along on the appointment, um, let you guys know how it goes. I'm a little bit nervous. Not as nervous as I was for the root canal, definitely, but still a little um, uneasy. <laughs> oh, I'm wearing, I know you guys can't really see and I'm trying to pay attention to the road, but I'm wearing that bun thing that I introduced in like the hair hack video. I have been wearing this bun like almost every day for work, no joke, I love it. It like, it makes my morning so easy. Um, and it's pretty much like a guarantee okay hair day, which is better than a bad hair day. <laughs> but I do, I really do love it and I'm still using it. So if you guys haven't gotten one, like I still highly recommend. Oh, hi babies. I don't know if my Bubblicious is out there. I'm sorry, I, I just, <laughs> what was that? I just passed Ella's school. And there were a bunch of kids outside playing and I wanted to see if I could see my Bubblicious because I miss her so much, my baby. Oh, she looks so beautiful this morning. She always looks beautiful, but she's so sweet this morning. She's so funny. Um, but anyways, I will talk to you guys in a little bit after I get some work done and let you guys know how this dentist appointment goes. And then hopefully after that, that'll be, ooh, hi son. Hopefully after this appointment will be the last time that I have to deal with any major dental work or dental issues for a while. <laughs> I'm not guaranteeing it, but um, this was not fun. But at least I know kind of like what to expect now, but it also costs a pretty penny. So <sighs> deep breath, we got this. Oh, and I realized, I'm sorry, I'm like literally two seconds from being home, but um, I showed a couple of vlogs ago, I think in vlog 467, I talked about starting whoopie pies. Um, and it's funny because I had finally perfected my recipe. I was doing original chocolate whoopie pies, red velvet whoopie pies, and then I was doing a pumpkin for this season. And my brother tried it. I don't really like pumpkin, but my brother tried it and said it was really, really good. So I finally had gotten three recipes nailed down and then guess what shows up? For a delivery at work. <laughs> the cases of whoopie pies that have miss it, been missing for seven months. So my little side hustle has to kind of come to an end. Um, maybe not forever, but I I'm, I'm want to talk to TJ's boss as well and maybe do like a gluten-free free-range egg whoopie pie for them if they're interested because that's kind of like their thing. Like they're super like, look at my Ew, <laughs> especially that one. Uh, self tanning, guys. Um, it, that's kind of like their thing is gluten free and free range eggs. So I might like tweak my recipes a little bit to make them gluten free and then I'll obviously switch out my eggs. But I brought one home um, to just munch on, and guys, like, I'm awesome. <laughs> no, seriously, these are so good. I was like, play Ooh, it started melting a tiny bit, but I usually keep them in the fridge just so they're nice and firm, but mm, it was so good. I was munching on some. Like, not to toot my horn, but these are really good, so. <laughs> mm, maybe I'll show you guys how to make them someday. Let me know if you're interested in that, but I think we're gonna work on like a scone recipe too. I'm not sure, but I gotta go pee and go get him. 
go get some lunch. Just hey guys! <laughs> what? Are you doing this YouTube thing? You're not even at it. I can't even. Uh, it's, it's hard to get you on here because I don't have a lot of angles. Just put it on me, anyways. That's all they want to see. <laughs> when I go home, um, I wanted to look halfway decent. Anyways, I didn't end up getting my filling today. You and your funnions. Hi there. Hi, baby. I didn't get my filling I today. A I got a red one with that today. <laughs> yeah. Well, I got a red. I like the pink. Um, because what happened, TJ and I ended up going to TGI Fridays for some lunch. And my appointment was for 1.30. And 1 o'clock, I get a phone call from my dentist. Oh, I was like, what the heck? If you hear music, that's her iPad. I get a phone call from my dentist saying that they never got like my x-ray pictures or anything from the specialist who did my root canal so i ended up <laughs> i ended up calling the people that did my root canal and said hey you never sent this over can you like email them and he said yeah so my dentist ended up having them i'm sorry bro i didn't see you my dentist ended up having to reschedule with me because they didn't have what they needed which is really annoying because i really didn't want to wait to get this crown done i just want to get it over with but um, they said that they would call me back <laughs> once they have the information that they need and I still haven't gotten a call. So if I'll get a call by like tomorrow, uh, I don't know, afternoon, um, I'll call them again and try to get that figured out. But we are talking about the next holiday, which is Thanksgiving. All I hear is your crunching funnies. <laughs> Hi, bud. I'm waiting a second to update you guys because that road is terrible. Mm. I could have made it. What are you doing? This is weird. Did I right there? Anyways, every year for Thanksgiving, it's super hectic. Um, between the amount of houses that we have to visit, which this year we're going to his dad's, his mom's, and then my family is doing one big thing. So I think we're going to your dad's in the morning. We just started talking about this, but I think we're going to his dad in the morning. My family's in the middle of the day, and then we're ending at his mom's house. That's what it sounds like. But... I, we were just discussing like what I'm gonna wear and stuff and I'm like well because I'm so pregnant you know I'm just gonna find like a dress to wear or something and then I'm like well crap I don't even know what Ellie's gonna wear because even though Thanksgiving isn't a super fancy holiday I also still like us to be put together um, so that's the long story short that's where we're heading now we just went to Home Depot. I don't even know if you can see it, but we have the window for the bathroom in the back seat. We just went and got that. Um, now we're gonna head to the mall. I'm gonna go to the children's place and see if uh, see if we can't find anything for the holiday there. So we'll see. We just sat down for lunch. The bell is ringing. But no, like nobody's reacting though. No workers doing anything. No announcements being made. I think there's a fire downstairs. Is that somebody? I couldn't tell if it was an announcement or something. I figured in a real emergency, like. There would be announcements. Really? He said that you probably didn't hear him. He said the fire department has to come and shut things like this off. <laughs> Alright, well, Daddy's got your food. If we uh, see a fire, I'll let you know. 
it's okay. We're alive, guys. <laughs> so, um, it was very weird at the mall. I don't really know what happened, but they came and, like, shut, shut the alarm off. So, there wasn't, I don't know if somebody, like, triggered it or something. I'm not sure what happened. But in this next part of the vlog, I forgot to kind of, like, tell you guys what we're doing. We're finishing up our Halloween festivities. I know we're in November now. Um, but Ella had this little, like, it, it was like, I don't remember what the heck they called it, but it was like a little event held at one of the other schools. Um, and they had like games and they did a little parade around the gym and stuff. So that's pretty much what we're doing. Um, I invited like my mom and Amber and stuff to keep us company. So I got Ella all dressed up and uh, we went to this little event and she had a lot of fun. <laughs> Woo! Nice job. Try to throw them in. Baby, go ahead, honey. <laughs> Good job. Yep. All right, entertainment will join us in the middle of you. We're gonna start with most creative. Third place, most creative is 118, 118. The eyeball. <laughs> Lots of Halloween parties. <laughs> oh. What are you doing? Playing in the pocket. <laughs> yeah. Where? Oh. 